Hello, silly fan topics fans. I'm Kevin Ripa, and this is my Sans 3 Minutes Max. Uh, in the last episode, we started talking about security layers on a Mac. I want to back up a little bit first and talk about how we can even know what kind of a Mac we're dealing with. Obviously, if you're looking at an iMac, uh, you can see what it is. Laptops are much more difficult to determine. So I'm going to direct you first to the back of the laptop we can see these really teeny tiny numbers and letters and stuff here. We're gonna take a picture of that with a phone and then we're gonna blow the picture up so we can even read it. Now we can see in this first example that we have a model A1398 and a corresponding serial number. In this second example, we have a model A2141 and a corresponding serial number. And then in this example, we have model 2337 and its corresponding serial number. They all look very much the same. The only one that you can really tell something off of is the first one. Here it actually says 2012 Apple Inc. They don't do that anymore. But what is inside? I mean, what's newer, what's older? As the model number gets larger, the model gets newer, obviously. But what can we tell from that model number before we even open the Mac up? Well, for that, we're going to go to a website that you see on the screen, support.apple.com forward slash specs. And you're going to put in the serial number. Press enter and you'll find out that this serial number belongs to a MacBook Pro 16-inch 2019. I can tell a lot from that. One of the most important things I can tell is that it's definitely going to have a T2 security chip, which is going to change my approach to the forensics of this device. I can click on the specs. I'm going to get a listing of the specs that were available for this device. You could order it with what size of hard drives, all the way up to 8 terabytes. So it doesn't tell you which one this one had, but it does tell you what options were available at the time. I want to show you one more just to show you why it's so important to look at these serial numbers ahead of time before you start working. This is a MacBook Air M1. All bets are off. We don't even know what's going to work on this right now, but we know our standard methods are not going to work. And I'm going to be coming to you uh, with future episodes of what our findings are of the M1 Apple product. But here we can see that it is an M1. Looking at the chassis, you would have never known. It could have been a MacBook Air, MacBook Pro. Um, but next episode, we're going to talk about where else we can get information once we can see the machine. In other words, the machine is on. But in the meantime and in between time, that's it. Another episode of 3 Minutes Max.